So what is Business Central then? Yeah. It's a really good uh, application that can help you do your day-to-day -day business. Welcome everyone. My name is Alessandro and I'm here today with Kim answering another important question. What is Microsoft Dynamics 365, but specifically Business Central? You mentioned Microsoft Dynamics 365 and that's the family that kind of brings together a lot of different software products. Business Central is one of those products, one of the family members, you could say. So what is Business Central then? A really good uh, application that can help you do your day-to-day -day business. It comes all from starting out with accounting, but it can do so much more for different types of uh, setups, different types of companies. Business Central is an ERP system, right? Like, so it's, it allows uh, the, the company to plan the resources. And like you mentioned, finances is definitely one of them. But what are some of the other components that uh, Business Central can uh, help your business with? It's a lot of different components in Business Central. And as you say, it all depends on the company. So, and that's one of the great things about Business Central. It might have a lot of different modules or capabilities in there, but they're all linked together. So it, we make sure that all goes together. Whenever you make any changes to a manufacturing, it actually goes into accounting as well. And it should do that, of course. That's one solid, coherent system that makes sure that it all works on your day-to-day -day business. And that is extremely helpful also when it comes to reporting, analysis, data, and because instead of having to go to three or four different places, you have everything centralized and it's easier also to see what's going on with your business. That's a very good point because one thing is to run an operation, manufacturing, for example. And of course, Business Central have information and, and tools that can do that. But here's another great thing about Business Central being part of Dynamics 365 and being part of Microsoft. So take a Power BI, for example. Power BI is a reporting package. It's really good for extracting data, presenting that with graphs and so on. And that integrates uh, easily into Business Central and can extract information, just like you mentioned, to present that to the user in a different way. So the user doesn't really have to go into Business Central. They can just see Power BI and look at the data from there. Is it uh, mainly geared towards like uh, very big businesses? So or could you also just be a smaller one uh, that is starting up and then is starting having some needs with manufacturing and accounting part? It can actually cover a lot of different sizes of companies and complexity even from the smallest type of business to medium sized, even bigger sizes companies we can handle as well. A great uh, advantage because it means that if you get on a product like this, you know already, even if you're small, you're not going to be limited as you grow and, and get bigger. Good point because, you know, getting into a new system, a new software package can be costly and it can take a lot of time. So if you make sure that you get in and use a system like Business Central, you just keep on working with the same system and use more and more of the functionality that exists in that product. I'm trying to picture myself as a, as a, a new business that is starting up and trying to choose which solutions uh, work best. Is it very complex and difficult to start with, with Business Central? Getting started with Business Central is not really that complex. Business Central runs in the cloud. That means uh, all that's set up with servers and all of that complex technology. We don't really have to put too much thought into that because Microsoft will take care of that because it's running in the cloud. A little bit like a click and install and you're up and running. What is the process to get started? The next step is to contact the company just like us, who's in the business. We've done this so many times before. We help people get started. So, you know, contact us. We can help you. That's right. We hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, make sure you write them in the comments down below. We'll make sure to get to them as soon as possible. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.